friends, it's Adam. Welcome back to The Dollist. Um, I'm super excited today because I have a doll that I have been wanting since I was a kid. Um, but she was a limited edition doll and my mom was like, no, I'm not going to buy you an expensive limited edition doll, which I don't blame her because I was a kid and I, excuse me, probably would have ruined her. So I'm super glad I got her today. Um, but it is one of the Barbie Millicent Roberts collections. Um, this is a collection that came out in 2006 um, with a couple of dolls and this particular doll um, gift set is called uh, Perfectly Suited. Uh, she came out in 1997. Um, these were um, supposed to be kind of realistic style 90s Barbies, you know. They worked, they played, they had uh, really detailed accessories and clothes with them. Um, and I really want to start getting all of them. Um, they go on eBay still for a pretty, a pretty penny right now because um, they are very, very cool. Um, this one you probably see it's a little bit yellowed. Um, I did buy this one used off eBay and the box is a little bit damaged, but that's okay because I'm going to take her out of the box anyway, so I really didn't care what the box looked like. Um, but here she is in here with all of her stuff here. And you see Barbie Millicent Roberts, for those of you who don't know, that is Barbie's full name. So this was a set that, you know, it always said her, her full name on it. And in the background, you'll probably hear my bird. I apologize, he's a little noisy today. He's a little parakeet, but you hear him back there. Anyway, back to this. Um, on the back, you can also see some really cool artwork here. Um, it shows her day to night look. Um, so she is a, a busy office lady. And then at night, she goes out with her friends. Um, and some of the fashions that did come out that I wanna get, this is one that I'm really, really looking um, for, the all decked out. Um, so far on eBay, it's the most expensive one I've found. Um, that is my favorite fashion that I do want to um, get for it, and lots of accessories. Uh, on the back it says, uh, meetings all day, dinner at eight, how does she do it? Barbie keeps cool in a smart satiny suit that play, pays top dividends. For a busy office day, she adds a black bodysuit, matching pantyhose, pumps, and silver jewelry with her, in quotation marks, cellular phone. Organizer, zippy briefcase, the Barbie doll is a picture of success. A simple change to pale accessories, sheer stockings, quilted purse, pumps, necklace, and a luscious iridescent shell, and Barbie is ready for a night on the town. Now it also says, the Barbie Millicent Roberts is a limited edition collection of dolls, exciting contemporary fashions you've been looking for with all the quality, realism, fashion play, and beautiful attention to details you cherish. The entire collection has been designed from beginning to end with you, the collector, in mind. Um, so yes, I love this set also because it is the most 90s set that I could think of. So let's go ahead and open her up. Some of you collectors out there are going to kill me, but the box is already trashed, so it's okay. I got her for a really good price on eBay because of the box being ruined and I don't really care. Oh wow. She is even cooler with the box open up. I had no idea that her hair... I don't know if you can see it on the camera in the lighting. It's not, I thought it was brown, but it's like a, it's like an auburn almost. Uh, her little leather, this is very, very cool. And she comes with a stand and everything too. Um, let me try to get her out of here very quickly if I can. So this set, like I said, has been something I've wanted uh, for a really long time. Um, there's also an, the, another one that I've been really wanting from this set called Pinstripe Power. Um, that is a very cool Barbie. She's got like her, she literally has a Pinstripe Power suit on. Um, I really want that one. Um, she was also, in the 90s for me, she was really rare in that she was a, um, a Barbie, a blonde Barbie with short hair. Um, she has a short bob cut in that, and I thought that was really unique as a kid because I never really saw Barbie with short hair before. Um, now, thankfully, Mattel's been doing an awesome job about giving Barbie a little bit, um, a little bit more, I don't know, something different for everyone. Um, so there are short hair Barbies and, you know, side shaved head Barbies and, and all that good stuff with, um, you know, our new dolls now. But back then, Barbie had long blonde hair. That was how she was. So delicate. So some of the rubber bands in the um, set in the packaging are actually like falling apart in my hands because um, again this doll did come out um, 19 years ago. Wow, I'm old. Uh, so it doesn't surprise me that the packaging started to degrade a little bit. Oh, right. There is a little. There we go. 
there. And where did her bracelet go? Her bracelet fell off, so I just want to put that. Oop. It's just so much stuff in here that I'm, I'm losing stuff left and right. Oh, no. Ah, found it. So let's see here. Let me get her little... Oh, her bracelet's really stretched out. Um, that's unfortunate, but that's okay. I'm going to show her to you. Here she is. Look at that beautiful face right there. And like I said, her hair is this really cool, like, auburn, brown, red color. I had no idea. I've always thought that she had dark brown hair, so I am super excited to see that she is, um, that's a different color than I was expecting. Um, she has pierced ears with little silver earrings in there. She has this really pretty little silver um, necklace. Uh, she has her power suit on. She is a businesswoman. Um, she's got a awesome little lilac satin jacket. And, oh, is, it, is that a long sleeve top? It's, I'm gonna take off her jacket really quick. And it is a long sleeve uh, black top that she's wearing. That's really cool, I thought it was short sleeve. Um, so long sleeve black top and the little pencil skirt as well. Um, the pencil skirt also has a snap on it, which is great. It's not Velcro, so it's much higher quality. And like all the Barbies in the 90s, um, she does have her ring. So she does have a pierced uh, finger, so you can put a ring on her. Um, and then she has her black stocking. I love that it has the stocking lining down the back. And then there we go. She had a lot of rubber bands on her feet. Give me one second to get those off. If I can. There we go. And she has some simple black pumps on. And she is the regular 90s Barbie that has the bendy leg, twist and turn lay, waist, and then just up and down on the arms, and of course the head turns. Now accessory-wise, she has her ginormous cellular telephone, in quotation marks, on the back of the box it does say cellular telephone. Um, remember this is, the, this is 1997. Uh, she has her this is super cool. It's sticky right now. Um, I think it's just because it's been in the box for a long time. It's a little leather uh, day planner. And it's, uh, does it open? I think it might open, but it's just really stuck right now. There we go. Um, and it actually has uh, a little ream of paper inside. Um, so again, the detail in these really, really cool. So that's her little day planner. Um, she also has her, I if you guys could see the, uh, like all of the rubber bands are just completely falling apart. This is incredible. Ugh. This stuff's gonna need a little bit of a wash. It's, yeah. Anyway, uh, she has a little black briefcase. It does not open, unfortunately, so that's disappointing there. Um, it doesn't open. It does have these this great little handle chains on it, though, so I'm, I'm pleased with that, but it does, it does not open. So, that's a bummer. Um, she has this really cool purse. Now what I love about this purse, you can probably see like, um, it's made of beads. Like, these are actual little iridescent beads. I don't know if I can even bring this close enough for you to see. These are little iridescent beads in here holding up the purse. Um, the purse does have a snap on it. Um, and it does open up. There's some tissue paper inside right now. Um, you can always take the tissue paper out just like that, and you can put her big clunky cell phone right in there. So that's perfect. She always needs a spot for her big clunky cell phone. I, I love the fact that she comes with granny panties. Um, so she, these are her undies, um, and straight up some granny panties, and that's awesome. Um, and then she has her second, her second shirt uh, for her night on the town. Sorry, my bird's deciding to chime in on his opinion. Um, so she has this really cool iridescent uh, top. It's a lilac, it's hard to see with the lighting, but it is like a lilac color, and it's just really, really sharp. All right, I was opening the rest of the, the stuff in there because it was, uh, the packaging was getting a little challenging. Um, something really cool too, wow. The detail in this, this is um, a necklace for her, a secondary necklace, um, and it's got the same iridescent beads that the uh, uh, that the purse had, 
which is really cool. And it's got, it, it actually has a little clasp on the back. Um, as you can, uh, it's hard to see in here, sorry. Um, but yeah, it's got an actual clasp. That's super cool. Um, just because, again, you know, this is Barbie size stuff, so the detail in this, really, really, really amazing. Um, she also comes with a second pair of stockings. Because you can't go out on the town with black stockings, you have to go with the white ones, I guess. And she does come with a pair of white pumps that match her other pumps. These ones just happen to be white. Now, let me see here. I wanted to see if I could change her outfit really fast. Interestingly, her her top is actually a a little, little jumpsuit, which is kind of cool. And her let me get them off. Her black uh, her black ones are actual nylons. They're not stockings, so they do go all the way up around her waist. Um, let me see if I can get these stockings on. I know some of these older dolls that have been boxes for a while, they have a tendency to get kind of sticky legs. Um, and that's just, you know, they've been in a box for a while. It happens. They get sticky face and sticky legs. Basically, wherever there is uh, the rubber on here, which, again, I love the rubber legs. Mattel. Bring them back, please. That is one of my biggest pet peeves with the new dolls is lack of rubber legs. I know it sounds strange, but rubber legs. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm <laughs> Let's get her panties on. That's why she comes with panties, because the other shirt has built-in panties. And when she goes out on the town, you want her to be nice and, and covered. Barbie's a nice girl. A successful girl. And a nice successful girl. And I'm going to put her top on, too, because... I don't want her showing, you know, showing too much. My mom always taught me, like, make sure your Barbies stay dressed. That was a big thing with her, is she didn't mind that I had Barbies as long as I was nice to them and kept them dressed. So, no naked Barbies were allowed. There we go. So while I'm putting on the stockings, I'll put her other top on. Let's see if I can get this other stocking on. First one went on without much problem. Let's see if I can get this one up. Ladies, if this is how it is, every day getting ready for work or going out, I'm certainly glad I'm a boy. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. And get the stocking up. Go ahead and sing a song about it. Okay. Basically, you get the point. She's got her stockings on. Cool. Now you just use the same skirt again. Because it doesn't come with a different skirt because, you know, she's living up the office all day long. She doesn't have time to go home and change. You know, I don't want to risk breaking it. Um, I do want to I did really want to put on the other necklace. Um, you know, the, the, the pearlescent necklace that goes with this outfit. But I really don't want to break it. Um, and I'm not going to force it on video here. Um, because again, I've been wanting this doll a while, so I want to make sure that I'm taking care of her. Um, but I'll give her her handbag. She threw her handbag on the ground. She's she's done. I'll put on her little white shoes. She's got little white pumps on now. And you know, if she had her uh, if she had her other jewelry on, she would be good to go for the evening. So yeah, that is uh, the perfectly suited. Barbie Millicent Roberts collection from 1997. Um, I'm hoping that at some point I can get um, the other dolls in the collection and the, the clothes and accessories um, off of eBay. Um, maybe next month, the month after I can do one at a time because they're, like I said, they're pretty expensive. But hopefully. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Um, if you like the collection, definitely check it out on eBay. There's quite a lot available. Um, I got a good deal on mine. Uh, so yeah. Have an awesome rest of the day. Um, like, subscribe, share, whatever you want to do. I appreciate it, and I will see you next time.